Hey everyone, Mr. Risser here, and in this video I'm going to show you how to find and read comments that were left for you in your Google Slides presentation, as well as how to write comments yourself. When you submit an assignment, your teacher will give it back to you, and they might have left some comments about your work that they would like you to read. Let's go ahead and take a look at how you can see these comments and possibly comment back. So I'm going to open up my slides presentation that I'm working on. And this is how I would find any comments left for me. I'm gonna to go to the top right hand corner and I'm going to click on this icon that looks like a speech bubble with three lines inside of it. This will pull up any comments that were left about my presentation. As you can see, Mr. Risser left a comment about a word swelled. Um, I don't know where this is, but I can find it very easily by clicking on the comment Mr. Risser made. This will take me right to where Mr. Risser left the comment in the document. You can see the word swelled here is highlighted with a green box around it. This is where Mr. Risser left the comment. His comment was, this answer is incorrect, please try again. So in order to get rid of this comment box so I can see my work, I'm just gonna click on the speech bubble again, and that'll hide the comments. And I can see what I did here. The bellman swelled us to our hotel room. Obviously, that is not the correct answer. Mr. Risser wants me to fix it. So I'm going to select the text box, double tap inside it to get the cursor up, and I'm going to try again. I think the correct answer is escorted. The bellman escorted us to our hotel room. So I'm gonna put that in the box, click out of the box, and open my comments back up by clicking on the speech bubble. I'm going to reply to Mr. Risser's comment. And I'm going to say, I fixed my mistake. Period. And then I want to hit the check mark to enter my comment. What will happen then is Mr. Risser will get notification that I commented on his comment. He will see that I fixed my mistake and he will hit the resolved button, which will mean that the mistake was fixed and this comment is pretty much over. I hope that helped you figure out how to read your comments and leave comments. If you still have any questions, contact your teacher for more help.